Well, hey everybody. I have a little special video for you guys today. I uh, hit 50,000 subscribers recently and I've been putting together a video highlight reel from the whole past year looking back on all the rides that I've done since I restarted my channel last fall. Before the video starts, I just want to give a huge thanks to everybody who has watched, subscribed, commented, liked, everything. I mean, you guys are a huge part of this and the only reason that it's still going. So you guys make it happen and I'm super grateful for everything. So thank you so much. Just so you know, I'll be time stamping every section of the video down below in the description. I want you guys to be able to go back and look at any videos if you see anything in the highlight reel that you feel like you missed or you wanted to see or watch again. So they'll all be linked down below. And without further ado, here is the highlight reel from the past year.
I hope you guys liked the video. I've never made a big compilation like that before. It was definitely a bit of a project and I learned a lot while I was making it. So hopefully uh, you guys enjoyed it. Um, there's a couple other things need to be discussed here. Some good stuff and some not so good stuff. About a month ago, I crashed on my fat bike and overshot this jump. Just went a hair too far, went nose down and uh, got tossed over the bars pretty good. So um, in good old Pete fashion, it's on video. So here's the video of that. The series of events that led up to that crash are kind of interesting. I had hit that jump five or six times, was landing right in the sweet spot, saw a buddy, had him come over and film it. Third time I went to hit it, I overshot, and here we are. So because that happened, I ended up uh, separating part of my shoulder and tore some ligaments, so I haven't been able to ride or do anything fun for about a month now. Uh, I've been out of the sling for about two weeks, and I've been doing some rehab, and you know, the muscle and everything, is the, the shoulder's getting better, it was my right, my right shoulder. Um, you know, the, it, it was unfortunate and things happen, you know, I like to play hard and I like to push my abilities and now and then you go down. So it was unfortunate, the timing wasn't very good and I ended up missing out on a big trip to Michigan, but you know, it was a learning experience and all I can do is take what I can from it and try not to do it again. So um, the positive side of that is that I should be riding soon and I'm actually looking into getting a stabilizer for the wheeler. So. Stabilizer is definitely going to help keep me safe, help my shoulder as it recovers um, so that I can get out and start riding sooner than I would have if I didn't have the stabilizer. So it's pretty exciting that there's a product like that available to help me get back to riding. The other news is I'm having a website being built right now and the plan is to sell merch, which is pretty exciting. So the first round of merch is going to be a t-shirt and a hat and maybe some stickers. Uh, the goal is to hopefully use the funds and proceeds from the merch to fund future trips. Maybe go on bigger trips, go further away, and hopefully ride with more of you guys. So it's just the beginning of the merch game, but I'm excited about it and it should change things a little bit. And I'm excited to hopefully have a few more funds so that I can take this to another level. I'll definitely be announcing more about the merch in the coming weeks once we get a little further along, but I'm just excited to share it with you guys right now. And uh, it's been quite the past month, but things should start going again here and seasons are changing and hopefully I can get out and rip it up a bit more before the snow flies. So. I really appreciate you guys' time today. Uh, it's been quite the year reflecting on everything and I'm excited to see what the future holds. So as always, you guys have a good one and thank you for watching.